have something you're gonna love. Mm. Get ready to have an orgasm. What? Oh, open wide. Mmm. Good? Mmm. Mm. Oh. Do me. You're so lucky I'm gay. something? Shoot. How do you do it? Do what? Give a head. What? A blowjob. I mean, do you start um, on the tip of his penis? Do you stroke it while you use your mouth? Do you tickle the balls? Not everybody likes that. <laughs> As a person who gives them and receives them, you must know the perfect way. Show me. Oh! Uh, Okay. <laughs> um. Um. Ah. <laughs> you. I didn't smile at it. Um. You know, I got an idea. Why don't you show me your technique, and then I'll critique it. Okay. 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 <laughs> So look, first, mm. I slowly lick the tip with my tongue, right? Uh. Right? That's good. Then I gently go down the shaft with my lips. And at the same time, I tickle the balls very softly. Then I twill my tongue all the way uh, 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 uh. back to the top. Then I wet my lips. Mm. I do a little playful nibbling. And then I sleep on my mouth. Ese huele rico me encanta porque es maravilloso. Come on, this isn't a sport. Football. Football's a sport. <laughs> Excuse me. Hi, can I help you? Hello, this is Peyton. And she's here for uh, this. So I, I guess I'll be back in a couple of hours. Bye. Well, class started 15 minutes ago, and we don't accept students without an audition. And that happened last month, so I'm really sorry. I'm sure maybe we can work something out. Money's no object, as you probably know. Okay, the thing is that this is a professional school, and... That's very nice. Thank you. Go change. Come on, go change. Yeah, let me see how she does today, okay? All right. I try, I try and get somebody. You get somebody. Your mom's sit over there. Excuse me. Thank you. Glissad <clears throat> grande te. And one, two, three. Very long. Come on, come on, come on. And one, two, three, four. Open up. Like a princess, chin up. Thank you. Beautiful class, everybody. Beautiful. Hayden, come here. Can I tell you that that was so, so good? Thank you. Our next big performance is in three weeks. But if you promise me that you're going to work extra, extra, super, super, super hard, we'd love to have you. I'll come every single day. <laughs> All day. Yes. Every day. <laughs> well, it is a ballet school, not a childcare facility. And when we make a commitment to a student, we ask that the parents make a commitment to the school. Can you do that? Uh, I think you can make a little exception for me. And why is that? You don't know who I am? No. <laughs> I'm Joe Kingman, baby. The quarterback of the Boston Rebels, number one on that field, and number one in your pretty little heart. The king of the gridiron. 
Never say no, Joe. <laughs> no? Nothing? Odd. Well, don't you know who I am? No. I'm Monique Vasquez, the lady with the ballet school. The one that doesn't accept any new students full time unless she knows for a fact that the parents are gonna help out. It's fine, fine. I promise, whatever. Let's go. She doesn't know who Joe Kingman is. She must be living under a rock. Okay, get on your feet. Enough! All right? Put that no. down! There's a bomb! Put that down! Hey! Guys, no bomb. Nothing. Now stay away before I throw you both in jail for obstruction. Throw us in jail? Lady, you must be out of your mind. I'm about to bust you right now. I'm an undercover agent for the United States Secret Service. Well, how do we know that? Show me a badge right now. Here you go. Let me see that again. I, I, I didn't get a good look at that. We can help you. I'm a detective from Hong Kong. I know who you are, Inspector Lee. I know. We need to go out of sight. So come down to my suite. Now look, I've been working this case for months now, so if I seem a little aggravated, I apologize. Well, you need to tell us what's going on. The triads and rain, they think I'm a crooked customs agent. Is that a payoff? No. That's a sample. You guys ever heard of the Super Bill? Yeah, I heard of it. It's a myth. Some kind of counterfeit. Honey. It's much more than a counterfeit. 14 out of 15 World Banks can't even tell the difference. The paper is crane linen blend, and the bills are printed in U.S. in Tagby presses. You want to tell us how in the world they get into the U.S. Mint to use the presses? In 1959, the United States was very friendly with the Shah of Iran. Why? Because we wanted his oil. Our government gave him a gift, a U.S. Treasury in Tagby printing press. Now, it's the only one to ever leave the country. Five years ago, Ricky Tan bought the press on the black market. Five years ago? Mm -hmm. That's right before he left the force. Early this year, Ricky Tan got a hold of one of a kind Swiss made on the dollar plates, and he started printing super bills. That's why Huli killed him, for the plates. And they've printed and shipped $100 million. There's only one way to spot a fake. They use an optical transfer ink from India that burns red, you see? Now the real ink, it burns black. So what in the hell are they gonna do with $100 million of phony money? You know, Carter, I believe you're asking the wrong question. The real question is, where are the plates? Because if we can find the plates, we can stop the whole operation. Right? Yeah, you're right. And you know what, maybe that's where you can help us, guys. Yeah. I mean, Carter, this is your city, right? Yeah, this is my city. I mean, this is my city. Great. And, Lee, you know who Lee and the Triads, correct? Yes. Great. So can you do me a favor? Can you find out where Huli's keeping the plates? That ain't no problem. Thank you. So welcome aboard, gentlemen. From this moment on, you're officially working for the United States Secret Service.